And I mean, shrooms, people can say what they want. I don't take them anymore, but people can say what they want. Mm -hmm. But it's a plant. It is. I've 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 had my experience. And let me tell you, what a shroom does is it heightens wherever you're at. So I feel like people who yes. have said that they've had a bad trip, mm, are you a little pessimistic? Like, you know, what was going on like yeah. in that time? Yeah. Because when I tried it with my best friend, yeah. I was happy the whole time. Yeah. I had the best shower. And it's so random, but it's like, I remember this entire day. It was our friend's living, yeah. which is like Thanksgiving, but mm -hmm. you know, we call it friend's living. Yeah. And the whole day, like I was looking at the ground breathe. Literally, yo. It was breathing. Yes, yes, yes. I'm so <laughs> glad you said that because people think I'd be like, here's the thing with shrooms. And I think it's subjective because I feel like you said, people with bad trips. Mm -hmm. Shrooms, you don't see Bugs Bunny. Bugs Bunny ain't going to pop I up. Like they say it's a loose in the gym. Bugs Bunny ain't going to pop up. But, Things with vibration, mm. people, plants, That's what it is. grass, all that shit comes to, to life, life even more. Yes. It's already alive, but you yes. really really see that mm -hmm. shit and that's why i you know was such an enthusiastic <laughs> of shrooms like not i didn't do it like hey i'm partying i'm on yeah. shrooms i'm fucked up yeah no i used to call them journeys mm -hmm. they weren't just like mm -hmm. i called them journeys yeah. like dead ass mm -hmm. like and yes like you said trees would yeah you know t not you talk would, to you. they would yeah yeah it was, you would see it was it. yeah like i would tell my friend like i remember when like i literally said i said friend mm. the brown is grieving she said what are you saying i yeah. said the brown is grieving she said uh, do you mean the ground is, is breathing i said bro i don't know what's happening yeah but i know i'm very happy but you I'm, know what's I'm, happening i was so happy and i was in such a great mood i yeah. mean usually I, i'm i'm not a moody person yeah. like either way like yeah. i you know i'm a woman i have my emotions uh -huh. but overall like the experience was I've not had a bad trip. Can I share my most recent? Please. This was like two years, but I've been taking it for two <laughs> years. I'm like, I gotta hit my guy up. But so I'm camping. First off, if I, if I could recommend Damn. anyone doing shrooms, definitely do it when you're in a nature setting. Okay. Definite. Nature you gotta setting. go outside. Matter yeah. of fact, just not to cut you off, but my yeah, girlfriend, yeah. whenever she did do it, she said she didn't have a good experience. And I was like, where were you? And she was like, inside. inside. No, you have, mm -mm. It's, it's meant to be with nature. So do yes. shrooms in a nature setting. Mm -hmm. I actually go bike riding throughout the city with a playlist when I'm on shrooms. That shit is amazing. I mean, I'd, I'd be gone for like six hours, but I digress. My favorite <laughs> shroom story, besides the third eye opening with Jimi Hendrix, I'm camping with my family. Mm -hmm. This shit wow. was just so amazing. All right, so I'm camping with my family. I have a shroom music playlist, which mostly consists of... You want it? I can send it to you. Which mostly consists of artists that are no longer with us in the mm -hmm. physical. Mm -hmm. A lot of Bob Marley, Beatles, Jimi Hendrix, Queen, so Freddie Mercury. Uh, so just a lot of artists that are no longer here. Rick James, Tina Marie. So we're at the campfire. The sun is down, the campfire is going. <laughs> and I'm listening to my playlist, boom, the shrooms kick in. I'm like, bet, let's do this, let's, let's go for the ride. <laughs> Got my playlist in and Two, um, two things happen. One, as the music's playing, I look up and you can see the trees through the light from the flame. You know mm. Bohemian Rhapsody mm -mm. by uh, Queen? So it's a part in that song where it's like a group singing, is this the real life? Okay. Is this just fantasy? So it's, it's more than one person singing. Yeah. I look up at the trees and I literally, and then if you know the music video, you'll get me. I'm looking at the trees and it's them singing through the trees, singing wow. down. Wildest shit ever. But here's where it really got wild. So I'm looking at the campfire. I'm looking at the flame. Mind you, I'm listening to all dead artists. Every single song that came on while I'm high on shrooms that had a dead artist, I'm looking at the flame, and each time it was a performance from the dead artist through the flame. Stop. I bullshit you not. Wow. Man. Fire and Desire <laughs> by Rick James and Tina Marie. I know that was lit. lit. I swear to you, throughout the whole song, there were two flames mm. performing that mm. song in front of me. The whole song. As soon as the song is over, the two flames kind of go away and it just mm -hmm. blend into the regular yeah. fire. That's crazy. crazy. I yeah. wish I was there, but you painted a very vivid picture. Yeah, it was amazing. That was amazing. 
Did you do like the chocolates or just like the actual like the actual um, plants? I don't yeah, do the chocolates. I, don't like the chocolates. I tried it once, but it didn't do anything. I think it's very diluted. I think you should yeah. either just eat it straight or yeah. do it through the tea. You can I'm make not tea a fan out of the it. chocolate. Yeah, nah, you can definitely do it through the tea, but I just, I just um, you know, haven't gotten there yet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So since we're on this topic, 